14 News Now, leading you into the future of how you get your news. Local, dependable, on demand. For News Now, we're Saul. I'm Phil Kuhn. A Syracuse man faces multiple charges after police say he can find a woman and her children into their house, attempted arson, and threatened to shoot officers. Police encountered 27-year-old Jaron Wiggs near Wawasee High School's auto mechanic shop around 5 p.m. Sunday. Wiggs allegedly ran towards police, stating his house was on fire, and asked the officers to shoot him in the head. Syracuse Fire Chief Mickey Scott later confirmed that lighter fluid was spread throughout the house and that the fire had gone out by the time the fire department arrived. Police then interrogated the owner of the home who said that earlier in the day, Wiggs had threatened to kill her in front of her children if she tried to leave the home. Wiggs was booked into the Kosciuszko County Jail on a $15,000 bond. A Warsaw woman is in jail for battery. 37-year-old Shelly Holly was arrested Monday night after admitting to police she struck a man with a baseball bat multiple times after he came to her house looking for his wife in June. Holly allegedly grabbed a metal baseball bat and told him to leave. When he didn't, she struck him, knocking out one of his teeth. Holly told police that the victim entered her residence without permissions. She then hit the victim with the bat multiple times when he refused to leave. When he did leave, she followed him and continued to hit him with the bat. Holly was booked into the Kosciuszko County Jail on a $1,200 bond. Your weather's coming up in 15 seconds. Get the vehicle you want at The Car Company in Warsaw. You'll find more makes, models, colors, and styles of high-quality pre-owned cars, trucks, vans, and SUVs at half the price of new. And now your new full-line Suzuki dealership for motorcycles, ATVs, and scooters. The Car Company on US 30 East in Warsaw. Looking at your Storm Team 16 forecast, tonight will be partly cloudy and muggy with a low of 68. Tomorrow we should see a mix of clouds and sunshine with highs in the mid-80s. And Friday will be warm again with a high of 86 degrees and a mix of clouds and sun. The Kosciuszko County Convention and Visitors Bureau announced Tuesday the appointment of Jill Boggs as the new executive director. Boggs was named as the Warsaw-based tourism organization director after the resignation of former director Mary Kittrell in May. Boggs comes to the Kosciuszko County Visitor Bureau with experience directing university marketing and a city chamber of commerce. As a previous executive director of the Angola Area Chamber of Commerce, she and organization volunteers grew membership and programming, earning recognition as Indiana Chamber of the Year. From the newsroom, I'm Phil Kuhn. Have a great day.